Barton and EJB Marie Laveau take home the gold and over $16,000 in the senior tie down roping. James had a big comeback to the world title. Oh, it, it's been a long time coming. Uh, I had a hip replacement a year ago, and so it's been a, a struggle to battle back. And, and we hope he misses her mayor, and I was just glad to do it. We had a great run. Susie Royalty and J.D. Yates earned the Junior Heading World Championship and a hefty check for over $25,000. Owner Phil Tierney shares with us how he came to own Susie Royalty. One day I'm looking on Facebook Marketplace of all things and, <laughs> and, and then I go back to Facebook and Tate Kirkenschlager had this filly on there for sale with a video of her rope and heading. Luke Jones, another horseman here, started the filly. Then it went to Tate Kirkenschlager and then we bought her and uh, you know just kind of fall into place sometimes jd said yeah let's buy her and here we are today miles baker and pride and joy are the junior healing world champions the team took home nearly twenty six thousand dollars not a bad payday for a first time exhibitor at the world show trevor brazil is my partner and he had family stuff and couldn't be here so four or five days before the show, he said, you're up. Fortunately, I know the horses all like the back of my hand and of course, he's, he's just, he's amazing. And I'm just thankful to get to show him, you know, God, uh, God's good. Ryan Painter and Allocating Green come out on top in the progressive and senior working hunter. Allocating Green is by Allocate Your Assets and out of pocket full of green. Ryan talks us through the best parts of their go in progressive working hunter. Oh, I was thrilled, I was thrilled for the owner. She's been a great customer and followed our path to develop the horse for the year, so it's nice that it all came together at the end. The horse's owner, Darcy Stricker, talks about the road to getting the horse back on track after a bee sting. He was going to be my hunter under saddle horse. He got stung by a bee while my trainer was showing him, and he really suffered to get back on the rail after that. But the same trainer came up with the idea of jumping him after that, and he's just really taken to it, and has only been doing it about a year, so we're super proud of him. Tyler Haney and he's a frequent flyer are the Junior Working Hunter World Champions. Tyler shares how thankful he is to secure a big win for the owner. Hijacker is a five-year-old gilding by the Mile High Club and he was bred by Becky Schooler and Todd Yoder of Ohio and he's owned by Kate Upton of Jupiter, Florida. And we've had him for the last couple of years. Becky, George and Colton Pillman sent him to us to learn how to jump and he's been awesome ever since then. So really like to thank all three of those people.